What's up guys, this is Jesus Quesadilla, and wow, bitches be all up in my grill. Alright, so once again, thank you for joining me. Welcome back to Let's Play Grand Theft Auto Vice City on the PS2 slash Xbox. My PS2 disc is still damaged, so we're going to resume play on the Xbox. I'm going to race over to the Malibu Club, and I'll check you guys in a second. And we are here. Okay, so we're going to stop by and see what Kent Paul wants to tell us about. This is going to be related to Diaz and his series of related I'm missions. I'm gonna save your beer, mate. What the hell are you talking about? You know that wanker Diaz, the Bugelmeister? Boy, I do, mate. Lugs, word is you might try to jump. You didn't jump high enough, if you know what I mean. Where did he take them? Ah, oh, all right, all right. In plain English. Keep your party on. They caught him across town the junkyard. Oh damn, okay guys, so things are heating up. Yeah, alright, so like I said, things are heating up. Lance has gotten himself into some trouble with Diaz, and he is getting jumped by Diaz's goons as we speak. Lance's health bar is up there, and it is going to be depleting urgently, so we need to race on over there. This piece of crap car probably isn't the best thing for this mission, but you know what's what I started with, so it's just what I'm going to roll with. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and see if I can race on over there as quickly as possible. Uh, while we're going over there, I'm going to go ahead and outline a few things for this mission. Uh, I went ahead and stocked up on armor and weapons because, like I said, Diaz's goons are going to be there. At this point in the game, we have cut our ties with Diaz, and he is going to be trying to erase us. We have to erase him first. So, we're racing over there right now. Lance's health is uh, depleting. I wish uh, I can speed up a little bit here. I'm kind of tempted to actually get out of the car and steal one of these faster ones because this car is going a little too slow for my liking. So, we're almost there at the mainland, though, and God damn it, car! God damn it, sidewalk! Okay, come on. Shake it off. Just keep keep going. Move out of my way, please. Loading screen! Not now, loading screen, not while Lance is dying. Okay. Whoo, woosah, okay. Yeah, I just calm myself down here. Screw driving on the right side of the road. I'm going wherever I damn well please. We're just going to go all over the place here. Alright, so as you approach the junkyard, you're going to want to have a lot of speed built up because there's going to be a little bit of a roadblock set up by Diaz's guards. So, we're approaching that right about now, it looks like. As we turn in here, we just want to go full throttle and just plow through this car that's blocking the entryway. Try to take out as many guys as you can by running them over and wow, that car really didn't last that long. Alright, so we're going to jump ship. Switch to a really good weapon. I'm using the Uzi right now and just start picking guys off left and right again Do this as quickly as possible because Lance does not give you a lot of time to save him You have to haul ass in order to get to him in time So we're just going to pick guys off here one two three. I don't care how many bitches you send at me Diaz All right, so it looks like we're cleaning them out here. Also take notice. They're dropping a lot of money so Maybe not right now, but after you've saved Lance, once you've got him uh, freed up so his health isn't depleting anymore, be sure to pick up that money, because there is tons of it. Each of these guards drops a whole shit ton of money. Alright, so we're just going to race on in here, grab some money, and yeah, they have Lance tied up here. Poor buddy, man. Jeez. Alright, so at this point Lance has lost all composure and he just wants Diaz, I'm sure Tommy does too. We're going ahead and try to get Lance to a hospital though because he is bleeding profusely. At this point you don't have to worry about him dying from bleeding out though. Um, there's actually supposed to, well, where the hell is this, alright, you know guys, just one second, I'm sorry about this, I'll find it. Really? Okay, where is this truck? Uh, one second guys, I'll be right back. I'm sorry. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna have to cut that part out or something. What I was doing was I was looking for a dump truck and usually one spawns here. For this part of the mission, I prefer to use it to this car because usually... Well, not usually, always when you leave the compound here, some of Diaz's goons are going to chase after you. And if you're in the dump truck, they can't do a whole lot to you because the truck is so big that they kind of just bounce off of your truck when you're driving. But yeah, as you can see, when you're in this one, they knock you all over the road. So I don't know. Maybe it just didn't spawn this time for some reason. I don't know if the Xbox version of this game is slightly tweaked from the PS2, although I doubt that's the case. I guess I just got some bad luck, and I'm, I'm going to have to drive really carefully here because they already damaged me enough to make my car start smoking, and that's not a good sign. I really would
would like to avoid repeating this mission because, yeah, it's kind of all, you have to drive all over the place, and although it looks like they stopped following me, yeah, I don't, I don't see them back there. That's, that's kind of weird too, there's, they normally follow you all the way to the hospital, so, I don't know, may, I'm just catching a lucky break here, I guess, I'm not going to complain about it, but, huh, alright. Well, if they're not following you, then it's significantly easier. Like I said, maybe the Xbox version is slightly tweaked. I don't know, because I don't play it a whole lot. I usually play on the PS2, and on that version, they definitely follow you all the way to the hospital. Anyway, we're going to complete the mission right here as soon as we pull up. Oh, damn, shit is going down. Okay, so like Tommy said, in the next mission, we'll be meeting on the bridge at Star Island to have our final showdown with Diaz. But, because that is so significant, I'm going to give it its own episode, so we're going to call this it for today. And so, we're going to sign off and leave things here. We're going to resume... You know what, let me change the station here, I don't like this. Let's see what V-Rock has, uh, here. Iron Maiden! Okay, so with Iron Maiden playing in the background, that is going to be it for today's episode. Thank you so much for joining me. Once again, this has been Jesus Quesadilla. Leave a comment below if you've enjoyed the video. And that is about it. Peace. Iron Maiden! Never mind, I lied. Tommy. Tomás, it's Cortez. Look, the French are giving me all kinds of trouble, amigo. Them hypocrites. They spend a hundred years stealing from poor countries, and they call me a thief. Huh? <laughs> I'm going to need your help as soon as possible, amigo. So please hurry, huh? Tommy, I need you, alright? Okay, guys, for real. Bye bye Peace!